to take each moment and to live each moment in peace eternally. And let it begin with me. Let it begin with me. As we know, on September the 21st, 1981, the United Nations established and celebrated their first International Day of Peace. It is also the exact same day and birthday as our Executive Educational Director, Miss Diana Cole, or we call her Miss C. Here's some excellent information to help us with our powerful peace party. With World Peace Day quickly approaching us, the Young Eagles Success or Yes Club met today in order to show gratitude for the kids' diligent participation this summer and also prepare for their first annual vir virtual peace party. The Yes Club will be forced to go virtual on World Peace Day, which is September 21st. So the group wanted to prepare in advance on this Labor Day and show its excitement about running live on Facebook and social media worldwide two weeks from today. The Yes Club helps teach youth about character, respect, how to be a good citizen, and have a safe, fun place to call home. Just really helping them to learn how to indeed say no to all that negative stuff, violence, crime, and and all of those things and say yes to choices that will bring success. Mrs. C, we are so excited about you being so special because you were born on a day that they chose for an International Day of Peace. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I mean, you must really be special. Now, the Yes Club says that peace is positive energy that's and right. character excellence. Yes, sir. That's right. And I think that's you. Now, let's do just a quick history on World Peace Day. The International Day of Peace, sometimes known as World Peace Day, is a United Nations sanctioned holiday observed annually on the 21st of Ooh. September. Yes, sir. Ooh, yeah, we know about that day. Because that's Mrs. C's birthday. Yes, sir. Ooh. Uh -huh. So, see, y'all didn't know Mrs. C is global, so now she's global. Ooh. And it's dedicated to world peace, specifically the absence of war and violence. And so the Yes Club is the best club because we say no to violence. Yes, sir. yes, sir. All right, now. And guess what? It's like a ceasefire in combat for humanitarian aid. We want to be able to help everybody in the world to get a break. Don't you think that we need a break from violence? We need a break from crime? Yes, yes sir. sir. Mrs. C don't need to have to deal with a whole bunch of stress. It's her birthday. All she wants is some presents and balloons and cake and flowers and money. That's right. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. And it was first celebrated in 1981. Ooh. And it's kept by many nations, political groups, military groups, and people. And in 1981, Two days after her birthday, in 1981, when World Peace Day was established, two days after that, in 1981, Mrs. C got married. Mm. Oh, y'all didn't think that was shocking and exciting? Two days 
days after her birthday in 1981, which this says, a World Peace Day was established in 1981 on her birthday. And two days after that, she got married. Look at y'all. Yeah. And everything would have been okay except for who she married. Uh oh, y'all done got frozen. Y'all look like the frozen chosen. Her only issue was who she married. Do y'all know who she married in 1981? Y'all don't know who she married? Carl, Oh, oh, wait a minute. I thought y'all was talking about World Peace Day. <laughs> But Mrs. C, we do give you our condolences and, and our sympathies for marrying Mr. C. Oh, that. <laughs> Two days after she got married, it was Mr. C's birthday. Ooh. I know y'all are just clapping because everybody in the whole world can see you, but let me tell you this. It was established by the United Nations. This is a global holiday and event. And we celebrate Miss Diana Cole and her birthday on this wonderful global all across the world holiday, the International Day of Peace, World Peace Day. How about a big happy birthday to Mrs. C. And that man, that nutcase that she married in 1981, are very happy. Y'all could have laughed then. Are very happy. Y'all could still laugh. Are very happy. Why ain't y'all laughing louder than that? Are very happy to present her with flowers. We are presenting her with two bouquets of flowers. Wow. Mrs. C, you got two. That thing is heavy. You got two. Wow. She's got a gift bag and it got an envelope in it. Oh. She's got a, a thing on here that says birthday blessings. Look at this. That's that nice. Everybody ought to see that. And I don't know if y'all can see it. You might have to stand up. Look at that birthday cake she got. She got a cake. That is a cute cake. Another bag of goodies and those nice balloons. And I want you to know that Mrs. C still looks as young as she did when she married that nut in 1981. Uh -huh. Don't you look pretty? All right. Now, Mrs. C, we want to know what you want to tell the whole world on this World Peace Day and our first virtual celebration all over the world, all on Facebook Live, all on YouTube, and everywhere. We want to know what you have to say to the whole world. Thank you, Mr. C. Thank you, Yes Club. There you go. There you go. All right. I know some guys like to go over these, but that's it. All right. Uh, Mr. C and Yes Club and parents, I just want to say um, that I'm excited to be fortunate enough to share my birthday on a global holiday that is all about peace. Mm -hmm. And um, I think the greatest thing that I can say about Peace Day, World Peace Day, especially in the season that we are living in, is that it is really powerful to have yourself, parents and guardians, 
and most importantly, young people mm -hmm. who are really, really excited about saying yes mm -hmm. to all those great things that are important, which includes peace, not only in the world, but in their neighborhoods, in mm -hmm. their communities, in their churches. And I'm most proud today on World Peace Day to say, yes, Club, you are fantastic. What you stand for, the things that you're doing, what you believe in, those wonderful, wonderful things that you've done even for me today on this special day. I say thank you. I don't know any better youth group than you. And I agree that the Yes Club is indeed the best club and certainly should celebrate a day like today on World Peace Day. Let's give them one more peace. Okay, hey, Here are some special moments from our event last year when Mrs. C celebrated the Big 6-0. In these clips, we also acknowledge our longtime supporter and friend, Dr. T, with some great remarks and musical tributes. Ladies and gentlemen, Dr. T and his wife Patty have been supporters of youth, not only on a local level, but also regional and national. Dr. T is somebody and he is my friend, and I love hearing him sing. We love you, Mr. C. He knows what he's doing. Remember, whatever you can conceive and believe, you may achieve. All right. All right, now. Okay. It could be the Boy Scouts. It could be the Key Club. It could be Big Brothers and Big Sisters. It could be the Yes Club. It's just important to make sure you stay involved yeah. and make sure that you got Jesus in your heart All right. yeah. and you got Mr. C teaching you how to sing. Come on, Dr. Yeah. Everybody, look who's coming
21st is Diana's birthday. Yes, sir. The 23rd is your anniversary. Yes, sir. And the 26th is your birthday. The 25th? Oh, I was off by one day. So, so 21, 23, 25, isn't that easy to remember? Yes, sir. So have you sung happy birthday yet? Yes, sir, but you should do it again now that you're here. In, in the key of T? <laughs> Everybody, yes club members, stand up and let's sing. Happy birthday. I've been up and down and 